guys, it's Katie Bishop with Prairie Earth Farm. I'm going to show you how we take care and raise our garden plants that we sell at the farmer's market. First, we start with soil blocks. And if you're not familiar with what those are, they are compressed mixture of soil and compost and natural fertilizers and minerals. And we do this because it helps lessen transplant shock and it also increases moisture for the roots and the plant and just generally makes them more happy. Of course, we're always going to use organic seed. And we do this by seeding each individual seed by hand into each little soil block. It seems monotonous, but it's actually very enjoyable in the spring when you're in the hoop house. Next, we spread a thin layer of vermiculite over the top. We do this to help retain moisture, and it also makes the little seedlings journey up through the soil easier. And then they grow into these adorable little seedlings. There's a lot of them. <laughs> we store those seedlings in our transplant house, which has a furnace and is also heated by the sun's heat via the plastic covering. This keeps them safe from temperatures. And we're watering. We water twice a day. And sometimes we water our employees too. <laughs> So when we're potting them up, we're using that same soil mix and we use peat pots that you can plant directly into the ground. And then voila, you have your plant with a handwritten plant tag for identification. We bring all of these plants outside onto racks and onto our hay rack. This gives us some space and it also helps them harden off or transition to outside temperatures and wind. And just makes for healthier plants when you're putting them into the garden. We have a lot, <laughs> we have a lot of plants. We do this also so that when we fill in orders, we can make sure that they're very accurate and what you ordered is what you got. There's our happy tomato plant, healthy. You can get these at the downtown Bloomington Farmer's Market or if you were one of the lucky ones that pre-ordered it, you can pick them up at the farm or the market. Thanks.